Hi everyone! I'm going to quickly show you how to check the submissions you've received for any forms on your website, madewithwebsite.com. I'm also going to show you how to enable email notifications so you'll receive a notification every time someone enters a response on your form. Forms are a great way to let customers or site visitors contact you for general questions, to ask about products, and more. So I already have a website, and on it I have a couple of forms that I already added to my website. So to manage these forms, I'm going to log into my website.com account. Now I'm in the member dashboard and I'll click Access Website Builder to go to the site builder. On the left sidebar, you'll see forms. And if you don't see that on the sidebar, just click the website.com logo right here and that will take you to the sidebar main menu. So click on Forms. Now I'll see the different forms that are on my website, and to view the submissions collected from visitors for each form, you can click View Submissions beside the form you want to see. So I'm going to look at the RSVP form. And here are all the submissions. Now I'm going to show you how to turn on email notifications so that you'll receive a notification every time you receive a new submission on your form. So we'll go back to the form manager, and this time I'm going to click go to this form in editor. So click on the form section, and that will trigger the options for the form section. Now scroll on the left until you see where it says new submission notifications. So I see that it's already toggled on. If I click on it again, it will be disabled. So I'll just click on it and make sure it's enabled. So here is the email that you'll receive form notifications to. And double check to make sure that's where you want to receive your email notifications. You'll see this option include form data in email. So right now it's toggled off. And because this is toggled off, every time I receive an email notification about a form submission, it will simply let me know that I've received a submission, but I'll need to log into the Site Builder and go to the Forms Manager to see all of the data that has been submitted. If I toggle it on, so I'll toggle it on, now I'll also be able to see the submission entry and details in each email. So once these customizations have been made, simply go to Publish the Changes to Live. One more note, be sure to check your junk box to make sure your email notifications aren't accidentally sent to spam. If you find that a form submission notification email has been sent to your junk box, be sure to move the email to your inbox, mark it as not spam, and mark the sender as a safe sender and add them as a contact. This will help to make sure the next notifications will make it to your inbox in the future. So that's it for this video. We also have a more comprehensive video showing you how to add forms to your site and more tips on viewing and exporting your form data. Don't forget to subscribe to website.com for more website and business tips and thanks for watching.